Well, hello everyone, and welcome to another edition of Talking Bullion. Well, as you can see, I've got another constitutional silver purchase here. Picked up some more great American coinage for another great price. So, so I thought I'd take a few minutes, show you what I picked up, see what you think. So let's go ahead and take a look. Okay, so what we have here, this has a couple different coins in it. It's got 11 half dollars and 6 quarters. Then we've got 80 quarters here, so two rolls. And we have a roll of dimes as well. So what he did was he just took the extra 6 quarters and threw them in here. So let's go ahead and start with this, see what we have. So there should be 11 halves here. Let's take a look at those first. We've got some Franklins. Looks like they're all Franklins. So I usually don't look at them when I pick them up. I look at them later. Sometimes he tells me. Most of the time he doesn't. What we have here is 11 pretty nice Franklins. They're in pretty good shape. Pretty standard quality for just regular uh, junk silver that you pick up. But very nice. This one here is really nice. What year is that? 1952. It's in pretty good shape. Not bad. Take a quick look at one. So, all right. So here we have uh, our Frankies, and then 86 quarters. So the six quarters are in there. Ooh, love that sound. What a great sound. All these uh, look to be in pretty decent shape. There's a 51. 64 some toning, 57, another 64, looks to be in pretty good shape. And so, yeah, those are in pretty good shape. Let's look at the other uh, ones that we got. So here's a roll of quarters. The thing I don't like about these uh, containers that he uses is these things frequently get stuck in there. Let me go ahead and Dump these down. Well, these all look to be pretty good shape. You know, they're not going to be perfect by any means, but that's what I like buying off this guy because he uh, he sells his stuff that's in really good condition. And uh, there we go. Got that thing broken out of there. Hiding back on me. A 64. So 11 has. So far we've got 46 quarters out. So let's go ahead and get this other roll. For the total of the 86 quarters that I purchased. Those things, aren't those things just gorgeous? That one's got a little smoke on it, but that's okay. it will clean off easily. Don't really worry too much about it. And the uh, silver that's been in people's pockets. But yeah, I mean, I would bet you, I need to, you know what I need to do on these? I need to weigh them. I need to weigh them and see how that 0.715 works per ounce on these because these appear to be in very good shape. So I'd be interested in weighing them and seeing if uh, it's closer to the BU, BU number, which is 0.7234, which is the number that you use when there isn't anywhere. So you have another quarter stuck in here. So yeah, these uh, these tubes, they're nice tubes, but uh, things get stuck in them. Alright, I'll have to retrieve that one out of there later. And then, finally, in this pill bottle, see right on top, we have a very nicely toned Mercury, 1945. Camera doesn't want to keep up with it. But so yeah, on the dimes we've got uh, 40 Mercury's and 10 Roosevelt's. If I took my numbers right, well, look at that. 64, but in very nice condition. Alright, so let's take a look at these. Yep, you can see it's almost all Mercury's. 40 Mercury's and 10 Roses. Looks like the Roses are at the end of the tube here. So again, look at how good a shape these things are in. These uh, 
Mercury's just got some beautiful toning on them. I mean, just from being in people's pockets and sitting around, uh, just really, really nice toning on them. They look to be in pretty good shape. That all wore down. So, yeah, I really like buying from this guy. He gives some good quality, good quality constitutional silver, that's for sure. So, let's see, adjust my camera here a little bit. So, face value wise, we've got $32. So, we've got the, uh, the 11 Kennedys, the 86 quarters, and the 50 dimes. And what I paid for this, well, I gave you face value. Let's see, it's 15.72 ounces. So, almost 16 ounces of silver. And I got this for. 12 24 an ounce. How's that sound, huh? 12 24 per troy ounce. That means it was two dollars and 46 cents below spot. 246. This is by far the best deal I've ever gotten off this guy. So, every for every two ounces, I saved five dollars. So, that is really really cool. Five dollars off spot. So, yeah, so what do you guys think, huh? Wow. Just a great deal. So really, really adds a nice uh, nice amount of silver to the collection. Almost 16 ounces and well, well below spot. Which is really, really helping my dollar cost averaging, I'm telling you. This is just fantastic. So that's it for now. I appreciate you watching. If you haven't subscribed yet, why don't you go ahead and do that. And also, go ahead and hit that little bell there to be notified when I put out more videos. And also, check out those two videos that just popped up. Got some great content for you. I think you do enjoy them. And always remember, let's keep talking boy on.